They call him crazy just because he's made a career out of acting crazy. Here's your host, Alec Jonas. Wake up, everybody. The Bilderbergs are at it again. And if somebody doesn't put a stop to it, this cabal of globalist elites is gonna succeed in its master plan of meeting once a year to discuss trade policy. Folks, this is exactly what gets described in 1984, except for some of the details like rat face cages and sex being illegal and a couple other things. To be honest, it's been a while since I read the book and I'm understandably a bit hazy on some of the details. Ah! But that's not all. The Rothschild banking family is manipulating the financial sector as part of a conspiracy to get us all saved responsibly for the future. Even though interest rates are at an all time low and mutual fund that indexes to the Dow Jones industrial average offers better rewards than a savings account for not that much risk. My point is that anybody can be a part of the investor class as long as they put aside a little bit of money every month. Ah! But all of these groups are working for the Illuminati, who have been hoarding wealth and using it to control the world since World War II. So far, this secret cabal has lifted millions out of poverty, fostered the spread of gay and women's rights, and brought the number of war deaths as a percentage of the population to its lowest point in human history. I'd say they're doing a pretty good job. But we need to struggle against them. 1776 will commence again, the people will overthrow their globalist masters and will finally do what the Founding Fathers wanted us to do! Put the Freemasons in charge. He now secretly worries he might have been too hard on Hillary Clinton. It's Alec Jonas! Uh -oh.